What's going on guys, Ocho here. Today I'm going to be talking about Dirty Dupe Cars, Dirty Duplicates, for those of you who don't know what they are. Um, I'm going to be giving you guys an example. I actually made some Dirty Dupe Cars, just so I can show you guys in this video. I'm going to be showing you guys actually how to avoid actually making those. And if you made them, I'm going to be telling you guys actually how to get rid of them. So let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so I want you guys to actually pay attention right here in this part. I'm going to be showing you guys my two pink photos right here. So I want you guys to memorize the license plate numbers on this one, which is 05KNC626. So I'm going to go ahead and show you my other pink photo. And as you guys can see, both of the numbers are the exact same. Now again, guys, you guys never want that. You never want multiple vehicles with the exact same numbers on the license plate. Because if you guys don't know, a car is actually registered to his number on the plate. So as soon as you sell one car, the game's going to detect, oh, he has multiple cars with the same exact numbers on the license plate. I mean, that should not even be possible in the first place. So the bot's going to detect you, and that's how you hit a daily sell limit. The game realizes that you're duplicating and you're exploiting the game, so they hit you with a daily sell limit. So, yeah, a lot of people were texting me saying, oh, I hit a daily sell limit. What should I do? Are my issues dirty? And, guys, with the new Auto Shop dupe glitch that came out on the Tuners DLC, that glitch does not change the numbers on your license plate for you, which is why you do need custom plates. And I did say that, say that in the video. So, if you guys actually did not use custom plates in that when you were doing the glitch, if you were to go to your AC or whatever car you used to dupe and you were to take off the back and look at the plate, you would see that all your ACs would have the same exact numbers, which means that those are all dirty. So, guys, the only way to get rid of dirty dupes is honestly by just replacing them with an LG. You can't sell them or do anything with them. You just have to get them out of your account, just delete them. So just order an LG offline, just replace them with your SE to completely get rid of the vehicle. I mean, that's all you can really do unless people, I've, I've heard people saying that they're cool with selling one car every 30 hours. But I mean, that's not really worth it to me, making only 1.7 mil every 30 hours. When if you get the, if you get rid of the daily sell limit, you can be selling up to seven cars every 30 hours, which is almost 10 million every day. So, I mean, I don't know why you wouldn't rather have that. But, I mean, I guess some people are just over here like, I don't know why they, I, I'm not that patient, man, but whatever. But, yeah, guys, if you guys do have dirty dupes, I mean, the only way to get rid of them is by replacing them with an LG or any car that you order online just to completely delete them off of your account. Because you do not want that on your account, trust me. So, if you guys are going to still be doing the glitch, again, it still works to this day that I'm making this video. I'm actually going to upload this video as soon as I record it so you guys will know when this is uploaded, it still works. Um... Again, to glitch safely and you duplicate safely, everybody should know this by now. If you don't, then I'm about to explain it to you. Before you duplicate an issue, you want to put your custom plate on it so that once you start duping it, all the dupes will have the custom plate on it. Because again, you can have your custom plate on multiple cars, but you can't have default plates with the same numbers on multiple cars. If you want, you, I, I don't know if that's hard to like understand. I understand if it like is hard to understand. I don't know, but I mean, I've been doing glitches for a long time, so I understand how everything works. But again, if you're going to be duplicating, even if it's a glitch that does change your plates for you, I would still recommend putting custom plates on it. Even if it is a glitch that doesn't require them, I would still recommend using custom plates just to be safe. But again, before you do any dupe glitch, guys, just make sure that whatever vehicle you're using, it has to have, you, you have to put the custom plates on it before you start duping. And as, as long as you do that, then you should be good. And you should not hit no daily sell limit. Again, as long as you, um keep within the rules of selling seven cars per 30 hours and they'll go in, not going over that but yeah guys again dirty dupes are multiple cars with the same exact numbers on license plate unless it is your custom plate but if you don't have custom plates on them then they're dirty if the, multiple of your cars have the same exact numbers on the license plate now i've also gotten this question where is if i have a dirty car if i put my custom plate on it will it clean it no because you already made it dirty by duplicating in the first place and putting those numbers on it. So no, even if a car is dirty and you put your custom plate on it, it is still dirty. That's not how it works. So again, the only way to make clean dupes is by putting your plate on your car before you start duplicating. So yeah, if you guys have any dirty dupes, I would just recommend completely deleting them off of your account by replacing them with allergies or any other car. So I mean, yeah, guys, that's all you really have to know. Again, dirty dupes, multiple cars with the same exact numbers on the license plate registered to that car. And if you are going to be doing any other dupe glitches, especially the new one, then just make sure to be using custom plates. If you guys don't know how to get those, I'm going to be le leaving a link in the description on how to get them. And people are actually, are, we're also saying that Rockstar took out custom plates and all this, blah, blah, blah. They actually did not because the day I'm uploading this video, my friend literally just got custom plates like 30 minutes ago using the method in my video. So if you guys have any problems 
then I'm not really sure how to help you because I basically explained everything. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really sure why you guys would be having problems, but yeah, custom place out of the game. Again, people just like to spread rumors, just like that ban wave that was supposedly gonna ban everybody, but never happened. Just like I said. But yeah, people just like to be trolls, man. I mean, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, again, custom plates link in bio if you guys want to go get that if you don't have them already. And yeah, man, if you guys have any questions or want me to make more videos, just make sure to comment down below. But yeah, it's been Ocho. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. And peace out.